how many of you have caught yourself comparing yourself um, to other coaches? I know I have. And for instance, I have this weekend, and I'm ashamed of it. <laughs> um, I caught myself comparing myself, and um, that's something I know better than to do because, for one thing, all the time and energy that you take into comparing yourself to somebody that might be moving faster than you, you are um, preventing that from helping your business. That is the energy and time that you need to be working your business. So say you're a diamond coach and you want to be a 10 star diamond and you, you see this 10 star diamond and they're moving up so much faster than you and you can't understand why you're just still diamond. Um, it's probably because you're you're taking the time and the energy and comparing yourself to these other coaches. Do you think that they're comparing themselves to other coaches? No, they are actually working their business and they're comparing. They're not comparing anything. They're not comparing to anybody but themselves on how they can improve every single day. And so I really want to tell you guys that if you're doing the three vital behaviors and if you're doing the power of threes, you're reading your personal development and you're posting, you're gonna make it in this business. It's not a get rich scheme. It doesn't come easy. And sometimes it comes fast for others. It goes faster for others. It is easier for others. It's a learning process. But um, you are not, it's not going to be something that you're going to just be a millionaire overnight. It's gonna take consistent work and it's gonna take working through those really rough patches. Um, you know, I've been, I'm gonna, for instance, me, I've been three star qualifying, okay? Um, then I two star, I'm two star right now. And then I went back down to diamond like three or four times. And then that was, you know, and then I went back to one star and then I like back to two star. And I remember calling my upline coach saying, you know, I was in tears like, oh my gosh, what am I doing wrong? And I'm like, it's nothing that I'm doing wrong. It is part of the process. Okay. It's part of you have to go through those really hard times. It's like a test. You have to go through those hard times to get to the top, you know? So my goal is I wanna, my very first goal is I wanna get to three star, like ASAP because, you know, and it happens. You might lose the star and you know, it's not a big deal, you know, but you work, you keep working hard and quit comparing yourself to all these other coaches. Um, Brandy Botts is a great example of losing a lot of stars in I don't really remember the story, but I think maybe she was six or seven star and went down to two star or something. I don't even remember, but I'm just saying that you have to quit comparing yourself to other coaches because that time and energy should be spent working on your business.